Legacy Flower Movies. She's there. We're in Strathroy, Ontario. Wonderful client. Lovely to work for. We are doing a carport. Unfortunately, in this situation, it was left too long. Got a lot of rotten wood, a bit of framing to do. Come on, show you what it looks like. So go ahead right now. You can kind of see the overseat. So it looks like we have framing to our right. We had to sister some joists, put new fascia board. Over here, we had a lot of framing to do. We got to remove the existing plywood and put some framing points in. We have new fascia we had to install just because it was too wet for too long. Sometimes we can go over the roof. In this situation, not only do we have to remove the roof, but we have to have some woodwork. We're going to do that. Uh, we'll show you what it looks like before we get the face on. Thanks a lot. We finished yesterday. We finished tearing off all the rotted wood. Now we reframed it so it's structurally sound. Um, go ahead and take an overview look. Now we have a roof that can support the weight of humans walking on it, as well as the uh, just the new construction. I'll show you also a detail, pretty unique detail we have to work around. So the old flat roof ran under here and across. Uh, this has been framed in, uh, timbered frame. So you can see the old flat roof here. We now, I want to make sure the water that lands on this roof no longer can access underneath here. We have to close all this. So the plan today is get this thing based in, maybe some metal flashing around, okay, we'll see. Okay, welcome back. We finished day two, we had a great day, accomplished a lot. We basically turned this carport canopy into a, a building that was almost ready to be torn down, reframed it, ready to go. Go ahead, take a look. Now, before there was a lot of wood on the perimeters, we had to reframe this and now to support the load. What you're looking at now, we have a base sheet, a pure stick base sheet installed. So all the flashing was done around the perimeter. And now we also had to enclose this. This is a elevated roof that was framed in over the old flat roof. They had a lot of leaks over there, so that got repaired. And now we enclose this. So now water can no longer get underneath here. That was an issue in the past. So now water is going to stop. This is the base sheet. We still have cap sheet, stop, and drain out where it's supposed to drain. There we go. Great job going so far in Strathmore, Ontario. Tomorrow, day three, we start putting the cap sheet, welding it, and do some details. So it really looks like. Thanks a lot. Legacy flat roof and sheet metal just finished the job in Strathroy. Three days between the framing, restructuring it, base sheet, cap sheet, metal work. Turned out beautiful. Thanks a lot to my client, Strathroy. I really appreciate it. Go ahead, take a look. This job really cleaned up nice. If you remember the photos and the video from the first um, roof, how it looked, we had rotten wood everywhere. You couldn't even get up here safely. We had to do all the framing from underneath. Come over here. We had to... We sealed this wall, so this was open before, you can put your hand in, water was definitely getting underneath, and the problem with that is just over time it's just going to rot the deck and the roof underneath. So we did this, we put a base sheet, cap sheet, sealed it with a monolithic layer on top, and there we go, that's going to tie in the old cap sheet with the new cap sheet, beautiful tie-in. We have a corner detail there and metal flashing around. Legacy flower Queen Sheet Metal, hope you liked it, hope you learned something. If you're in the southwestern Ontario, we'd love to hear from you. You can find us online at LegacyRoofs.com. Thanks a lot.